Thanks, Miss G. Okay, um, today being the last day of school means a lot of us are going to start taking our vacations. So, in order for us to take vacations, we're going to have to be able to get someplace. Okay, we need, we will be traveling places by using transportation. Transportation is the way we get from one place to another place. Okay, it, transportation can be used for people. It can also be used for things. This morning, I used a form of transportation. I mailed you all uh, some books, and so they will go from the post office. They will be transported in a mail truck and be driven to your house. So they are getting from one place to another. Okay, You are also going to get to use transportation over the summer to get from one place to another. Some of us might want to ride a train. Trains are a very cool form of transportation. Okay, I made a train right here. Here's my train. See? Woo -hoo -hoo. There's my train. Okay, all I did for the train, so that you guys can make yourself a train if you would like, is I got myself a, a Pringle cam, or just a, a, a cylinder cam. Okay, I used a piece of construction paper and I wrapped it around it so it ended up being like this I taped it on taped it onto it then for his wheels okay um, trains have circle wheels just like the cars but they have metal in between to hold the wheels together so when they move okay when they move they move like this okay so what I did is I hot glued the wheels are lollipops right to the side of my train. Now I had this I had more of balls instead of the circle ones, just the plain flat circles. You can use those as well too, and they turn out really cute as well. Now a train has a smokestack. So all I did with the smokestack is I took a mini candy bar, I wrapped it up with red tissue paper. Okay, and then I, I just hot glued it on. Okay, I used hot glue. You can also use um, the liquid Elmer's glue, but if you use that, make sure you hold it for a while and count. Remember how we count to 20 before we let go? So that's what I want you to do. A train also has a bell. Okay, so I use a Reese's cup for the, the bell. You can use any kind of candies you want to. And then the driver of the train is the engineer. He needs someplace to sit. So right in the back, is his cabin or his uh, compartment where he needs to be where all the instruments are to drive the train so if you are going to go somewhere by train this summer and I made the little face then you can make yourself a train I gave him eyes and for his mouth I just used a hard piece of candy I used a Jolly Ranchers okay you can also just color it with markers okay that's how you want to do it so that is for a train, that is one type of transportation that we can use. You can use a train. Another form of transportation is if you're not going to go far um, this summer, you are just going to drive in your car. All you're going to do is just cut out a car shape, glue his wheels on, decorate it, and that's your car. Here's my lights. Okay, so you're going to make yourself a car. Some of us are actually going to get to go to might get to go to the um, lake or to the ocean even okay and the transportation the transportation vehicle we're going to need for that is a boat okay so you are going to need to make your boat so what you need is you need to get you a piece of paper you're going to do a, a hamburger fold and the hamburger fold is the fat fold where you're going to take your paper and just fold it down you're going to have to crease on top. Okay, then for that, for what you need to do next, is we're going to fold these two pieces down. Okay, until we get a point. We're going to meet right in the middle, and you're going to make a point right on the top. You see, I just folded these two down. I made a point. Okay, then you have two pieces of the paper is together. So what you're going to do is you are going to fold up on one. Okay, then you're going to turn it over. You're going to fold it up on the other side. Okay, 
there is my sailboat. You can also wear it as a sailor's hat. But we're going to use it as our sailboat. So you're just going to open them up a bit. Okay, and here is my lake. So we're just going to put, a, put our water in the lake and we're going to go sailing. Okay, now because, it's, because this was made out of just paper, it's going to start sinking. You can see it's already starting to sink on one side. So if you want it to float for a long period of time, what you're going to want to do is use aluminum foil because aluminum foil will not let the water soak in. So it will float better, okay? But that is another form of transportation that many of us might use during the summertime. Okay, let me put that one right here. Okay, another form is if we're gonna go far away, if somebody decides that they're gonna go far away to another state or even another country, you're gonna use an airplane. An airplane is a really cool form of transportation. We're gonna take our paper and this time we're gonna fold it hot dog fold. Okay, this way you're gonna fold it in half, but the long way. Okay, so we're gonna make the bottoms meet. Okay, there it is. Okay, then these two parts right here, you're gonna fold them. All right, you're gonna keep them together, but keep the crease on the bottom. Nope, I was wrong. Okay, you're going to take one end, you're going to fold it in on itself like this. The crease is on the bottom, you just did one side. Okay, you're going to turn it over, you're going to do the other side. So now, there's a big point on it, okay? What you're going to do now is you're going to fold this down to the bottom. So now it's down this, all the way to the bottom. I made this seat, come all the way down to the bottom, so I folded them again. Turn it over to the second side. Then you're going to take it, fold it down one more time, okay, on both sides. So now he's just long and skinny, okay? You're going to hold it up like this, okay? And watch, whoops, okay, here we go, ready? And there is my airplane, whoops, he didn't go very well. Hold on, okay, there he goes. Okay, and that's your airplane. So a lot of people can uh, will be using airplanes as their form of transportation this summer. Now you can go online and find out lots of different ways to fold airplanes to make lots of different kinds of airplanes. Okay, that was just a really simple airplane. But if you want to make it, go online and look it up to find you a different directions to use. Another form of transportation is we're not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere for this summer. So we're going to be staying at home, but my daughter will be using a different form of transportation. She will be using her skateboard. So we made a skateboard, okay? And all we did for a skateboard is we took a Nutter Butter Peanut Butter Sanders cookie and we took some Reese's Peanut Butter Cups as the wheels and the glue you need to use to get it to stick on is you need some frosting. So we put frosting on the bottom of it. We stuck our wheels to it. You can stick it this way where the big side is out or you can have the little side of the wheel out. On this one, we did the little side of the wheel out, but you can also make it this way and they will stick on nice, okay? okay. So that is our skateboard. So depending on where you are going to go is going to decide what type of transportation you are going to need, okay? We're staying here, so my daughter will use her skateboard. Some people are going to fly away in a plane. Some people are going to sail away in a boat or just go fishing in a boat. That's uh, The boat is a form of transportation. Here is a car, so you're going to form a decorate up your car and here is a train. Okay. There are a lot of other types of transportation that you guys can use. Okay, These are just a few that I have made for you guys to see. Okay, um, Another form of transportation that we all use all the time. Does anybody know what that is? 
our feet. We use our feet. We walk. Okay? We walk from one place to another place. We transport our bodies from one place to another place. That is a form of transportation that we all use. Okay? So a good thing you can do with that is just get a very long sheet of paper. And if you don't have a long sheet of paper, you would just take paper and just keep um, taping them together until you have it really long. Then all you do is put your foot or both feet in a plate of uh, paint and walk along your paper. And you will have made uh, your walking feet transportation picture, okay? So, to get from one place to another place, we have to use transportation. It's the type of vehicle that is going to change. So I would like you to pick your favorite transportation or either think about where you're going this summer and what kind of transportation you're going to need. And you go ahead and make some form of your transportation. Use your imagination. I used candy. So you can use candy. You can use fruit. You can use paper. You can use anything you want to make your transportation. All right? So I'd like to see you guys make your transportation, and I'm looking forward to seeing them. Send me pictures of your transportation. All right? Y'all have fun. Enjoy your summer. And you will be seeing me still on YouTube. So I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.